Hi, I'm Erin McCarthy from MentalFloss.com. You know scientist Marie Curie from her discovery of radium and polonium, but there are plenty of things you don't know about the first woman to win a Nobel Prize. Here are three of them. Curie went to great lengths for her education. After graduating from a Polish high school at the age of 15, she wanted to continue her pursuits, but women weren't allowed to attend the University of Warsaw. She and her sister went to a floating university instead. Classes took place at night in various locations to avoid being detected by the authorities. Later, Curie would work as a governess to earn money to go to university in Paris, where she completed her master's degrees, first in physics and then in math, in just four years. One of Curie's inventions saved lives during World War I. Scientific research ground to a halt during the war, but Curie still wanted to help. She thought that field doctors could use x-rays to help save lives of wounded soldiers, but it was impractical to get those machines to the front. So she assembled a fleet of 20 cars, donated by the wealthy, and turned them into mobile x-ray units with equipment taken from labs and clinics that had been shut down by the war. The French called them Petit Curie. After more than a century, Curie's things, including her furniture, cookbooks, and papers, are still radioactive. If you want to read her manuscripts, you must sign a waiver of liability and don protective apparel, and only then can you remove her papers from their lead-lined boxes. No one will be able to examine them without that level of protection for several hundred years. I hope you enjoyed these Marie Curie facts. For more, visit mentalfloss.com and stay tuned to 92nd Streetwise, 7 Days of Genius.